and welcome to Baby M. Um, today I'll be doing the Absolutely Fabulous series, which means that it's a yoga series that you can do if you have too much to drink the night before. And I woke up this morning and I thought, you know, like, oh, I'm going to do this Absolutely Fabulous series and um, uh, I have a headache and, you know, it will be really amazing. I'll do some really slow exercises. And then I woke up and I didn't have a headache. And I thought like, hmm, okay, well, you know, I'll still do it, but I don't really feel hung over. And then I realized, oh, I'm so tired. So it's like, I've been um, up for like two hours and all I wanna do is go back to bed. So if you feel like me and um, are you really tired because you had either too little sleep or uh, you had a little bit too much to drink, then, um, uh, do this yoga series. I cannot promise that it will make you uh, feel more alive and give you more energy, but I can promise you that if you're done with this, then at least you will have done one thing that you can be proud of today. <laughs> so grab your mat and let's get started. So take your feet at hip width and relax your arms, relax your hands. Close your eyes. Drop your chin to your chest. And exhale, relax your neck. Roll your chin to the right. Inhale, lift your chest up. Bring your head back. Exhale, roll your head the left and then drop the chin forward again to the other side roll your chin to the left move over the shoulder inhale lift the heart up as you roll back exhale roll to the right shoulder and then move forward One more time on each side. Roll your head to the right. Inhale, lift the heart up. Exhale, roll your head to the left. And then forward. Roll your head to the left. Inhale, lift the heart up. Bring the head back. Exhale, roll your head to the right, and then drop the chin forward again, and inhale, bring your head to center. Open your eyes, bring your hands up, and then clasp your right wrist with your left hand, and turn your right hand out, so your right palm is out. If you want, you can... Um, Connect the thumb and index finger from your right hand. So you reach your hands up as you clasp that right wrist. And then you pull your wrist, you pull your arm towards the left. So you get all this space and stretch on the right side of the body. Tuck your chin in towards your left shoulder. And start to breathe here and really feel every inhale expanding the right side of your body and breathing the heart up and then on the exhale you can lean a little bit further towards the left to every inhale you feel the expansion and every exhale you relax a little bit deeper to the left Inhale, come up, clasp the other wrist, exhale, move to the right. Feel the breath again on the left side of the body, this time to every inhale, the ribs expand, the heart lifts up and every exhale, 
then lean a little bit deeper towards the right. Exhale, inhale, rise up and exhale, release. Now take your feet straight under um, your hips. And if you have a really thick mat that you're standing on, you may want to do this exercise on the floor. So lift your heels up so you come onto your toes. And you bring your hands forward. Relax your hands here. And then start to move your hands all the way to the right. Bend your left elbow and take your fingertips to your chest. And then to the other side. So you first you come to center. And then you move all the way to the left. Fingertips to your breastbone. And then come to center. And to the other side. Center and to the left. And then you release, bring the hands to center and take the heels down. Take your right foot to the inside of your right thigh. Now press your left foot into the floor. Can you feel the pelvic floor lifting? Bring your hands together, relax your elbows, relax your shoulders, gaze to the floor, and breathe to your belly. Release. To the other side, so your weight will be on the right foot. Take your left foot to the inside of your right thigh. Keep your right knee slightly bent and press the right foot into the floor. Feel the pelvic floor lifting and bring your hands together. Exhale, release. Take your left foot down. And then you start with the feet parallel. If you're using a yoga mat, um, start in the center of your mat so you have some space in front of you, you have some space behind you. Step the right foot forward. Take the left foot back and take the left heel down. Now inhale, bend your right knee, rain your hands up, and exhale, bring your hands to your heart, and open. Inhale, move back, and exhale, move forward, bring your left arm alongside your cheek, alongside your ear, and press your right elbow into your leg, lift up. Maybe you want to look up, breathe through your belly. Inhale, bring your left hand up and exhale, press your right foot into the floor. Start to straighten the leg, bring your right hand onto your chin or your lower leg or your foot. Inhale. Spin the heart open. You can look up towards your hand or you can relax your neck. And 
in and slowly come back up again and release the hands. So again, start in the center of your mat, but this time step your left foot forward and your right foot back. Inhale, bend your left knee, bring your hands up. Exhale, draw the hands together at your heart and spin open. Inhale, tilt back. Exhale, move forward, take your elbow onto your leg and your right arm alongside your cheek. Press your left elbow into your leg. Up towards, oh, well, towards the sky, the ceiling, whatever. You can look up. So your right arm will be alongside your right cheek. Exhale. Inhale, bring your right hand up. Exhale, start to straighten your left leg by pressing the foot down. And then take your left hand onto your lower leg or ankle. So either look up to your hand or relax your neck. Come up again. Bring your feet together. Come out of the pose and just shake out the feet. And you place your feet into a wide stance with your toes kind of pointing out in a diagonal. So bend your knees, really kind of like squat down. Take your hands with your fingers on the inside of your knees. Inhale, roll your shoulders back. Lift your heart up. And let your sitting bones point back. So you have a hollow spine here. Exhale, press the feet into the floor. Tuck your navel in, let your spine round. Take your chin in towards your chest. Inhale, drop the hips open. And exhale, press the feet into the floor around your spine. Inhale, open. And exhale, round. Inhale. And exhale. And you take the feet as wide as you can and you bring your hands down and take your hands kind of like forward and then you start to rock front and back. So I'll be doing this um, facing the camera and then I'll turn around to the side so you can see both ways. But just make your way down and find the position where you can shift the weight between your hands and your heels. And then you come up. I have no, no idea how instructional that last shot was. You probably just saw my right foot, but you get the idea. Okay, so you come out of the pose, and this is what you practice for today. Your absolutely fabulous yoga practice for when you're really tired because you had too much to drink. Okay, thank you. See you tomorrow.